this is Jolly Gaming Panda, and today we will be playing Pokemon Scarlet. This is a training session episode. Pretty much, I'm trying to get all of my Paldea Pokemon to max level 100. I got the first box finished. I'm almost there with the second box, just a couple more Mon. And there's an event going on that's really helping me level up my Pokemon right now. It's intended to help people who want to try and race and train certain Pokemon for certain... for Mewtwo next month. Because Mewtwo is gonna be available Terra Raid, Psychic type Terra Raid next month. I don't know what Pokemon I'll bring to that Terra Raid. I'll definitely do research ahead of time before I do that. But just for now, I'm kind of just leveling up all of my different Pokemon and just enjoying the game. I'm gonna try and hold off and have some Pokemon trainers join me. So let's hope this battle goes well. It's actually taking quite a while. Nobody's joining. Hmm. Hopefully someone joins soon. That'd be nice. Get some backup. Get some help. Hmm. It's been a minute. Usually I get trainers immediately. This is unusual. Hmm. Hopefully there's some Pokemon trainers help soon. If I get no one, I'm gonna cancel the battle. I think I'm just gonna cancel it right now. Just I'm getting nobody. So let's try that again, see if I get anyone. I don't know why nobody was joining. Hmm. Last time I was in a fire-type Terra and brought Walking Wake. Walking Wake just worked like a sh charm. Like a Chinese charm, if you want to put it that way. Uh, nobody's joining. Guess I should just wait it out. Wait out the majority of the two minutes. Rather than quitting as soon as I'm minutes over. Oh good, there we go. Getting better luck this time. I already got a Pokemon Trainer joining us. Looks like they got a little Dito. Bringing Ezreal Water type Mon. Looks like they're knowing. They know what they're doing. That's good. That's reassuring. Got another Trainer and Greg. Let's do it, people! Let's show this Pokemon that they're not the coolest Terra Pokemon around. That we, we're better, we're stronger. We're gonna put that Terra Pokemon in their place. Take all their experience candies for our own Pokemon. Because <laughs> we want some of that lovely. Okay, here we go. Oh, pretty shiny. Um, let's try Hydro Pump. A really strong move just to start things off. Wait, that hardly did anything, really? How would that hardly do anything? Um, what about Dragon Pulse? This Dragon Pulse does any... Wait, what? Wait, how's the HP at yellow? Did I miss something? Did the game lag? I, I'm so confused. That had to have been a glitch. Whoa. Guess we're just that strong. Too much for Hydrogen to... come... to... realize. Wait, was someone's Pokemon a name of a website? Did I read that right? 
felt like I just read a dot com in the description telling me wait monforge dot com don't name your Pokemon names of websites. Shame for shame. You can't just name your Pokemon the name of a website. Your Pokemon is your partner, your buddy. You can't just name your buddy buddy a website name. That would be like meeting someone in real life and being like, oh, this is matchup.com and we're good pals. Don't name them a name of a website. That's the worst nickname you could give your Pokemon. That'd be like nicknaming your childhood friend a name of a website, which doesn't really sound good. So, yeah. Don't name your Pokemon names after websites. Plus, I'm pretty sure most of those websites are scams. For sure. Ooh. Got some good experience, candies. That's for sure. Okay, time for some leveling up. I always have a blast leveling up my Pokemon. Actually, we only have one rare candy, so might as well give it to him. Ooh, level 46. Level 51, that's a good level. Wow, this is really helping me just max all of my Pokemon incredibly fast. It's insane. Is there any more Pokemon? I'm worried that I'm running out of Terra Rains. <laughs> I think there really is a limit to how many event Pokemon could spawn on your map per day, so I might be running out of them. Okay, here's our Crydon. I want to rely on Crydon again. Let's save real quick before we do anything else. And the Terra Crystal is really close by. My Coridon could smell it. Oh, this is pretty environment. Very snowy. Wait. What is happening? I guess Crydon can't climb on the actual waterfall. It has to be by the side. I wonder if Crydon could climb this by climbing over by the waterfall itself. But no, that doesn't work. So don't try it. Don't do what I just did. Ooh, little item. Thunderbolt TM, that's good. And over here is a electric Terra braid we could encounter ourselves. Let's see what this one is. Oh, a different Pokemon. I think it- yeah, it's still one of the event Pokemon. Let's see how we do. Now I'm feeling so spoiled with all these events. These battle events. It's insane. Getting so much experience from it all. It's great. Let's wait and see if anyone joins. If nobody does, I'm quitting. I'm canceling and I'm trying again. I think chances of success are just better with other players. Better to team up. Name to be sorry later if you fail because you do it solo.
But I know some people can't help but do it solo. To be honest, I've been doing solo for a long time with these battles. But I don't know. I'm starting to have a blast just doing it with other people rather than NPCs. Just doing these event battles with actual Pokemon trainers with actual people. It's really fun. Alright, let's see. Can we stand a chance against this? We're about to find out. Ooh, there is a lot of shinies going on here. Two of them, wow. Really nice. What kind of nickname is that? Uh... Yeah, I'm so judging all the Pokemon nicknames in this episode. <laughs> They got a good shiny for- oh. I was worried about shiny Freddy, the bear, because their HP, but looks like that was no issue. Wow. I'm actually impressed. I thought the battle wouldn't go well, but wow, we actually pulled off. Whoa. I'm impressed. Well, some of these are so easy, and we get so much experience candy from it, it's amazing. Ooh, level 55. Level 58. Mm, 85. I guess headbutt isn't really needed. Oops, I don't want to do PP up while I'm thinking. Hmm, is there any other events? There's a dragon one. I'm not too confident with the dragon one, but we'll have to do it anyway. I'm pretty sure all the event hero raids are starting to gradually disappear. Because of that, we should try and challenge each one that comes up as much as we can. So pretty through here. Oh no, not the Tauros. Those things are so aggressive. <laughs> um, we could give this a try. I'm not sure if I'm very confident, but we'll give it a try. See if any other players join. Hurry up, trainers. This will be an exciting fight. Don't want to miss out. Wow, we got a full house. Great. Let's hope this turns out okay. Hopefully. No tomfoolery around here. We we gotta give it our all, people. Come on. We could do it. Everyone has their Pokemon all set and ready. 
Except for Red Rose. Come on. Okay. Looks like if they got a cool Lucario they might be about to bring. You're bringing out... Cool, we got Lucario on the team. That's good. Good old Lucario. The trainer knows what kind of cool Pokemon to bring into the fight. Okay, let's hope this the, our team could pull this off. I don't know if I really do very many Dragon Terra's battles with Crydon, but... Looks like the moves are effective. Let's try Collision, of course. Oh, the damage ain't doing too much. This might be a no-go. Don't know if I'm speaking too soon, but I feel like it'll be a no-go. I won't give up though, but... Oh, wait, what? Did the game glitch? We're in the yellow, we're almost... Scissor's almost defeated. There had to be a glitch. This must be what Pokemon trainers complain about online about the game being glitched up. But it's okay, this is a pleasant glitch if this could even be considered a glitch. How pleasant to think that you're failing along with your team only to realize the HP bar is Practically down. Very relieving. <laughs> Just a little more. Being anxious, I might start using collision, of course. Mm, that's not doing much. I should hold off on collision, of course. Not until I could. Oh, I could terrestrialize. Okay, good. Okay, we definitely managed. We beat Scizor. That's great. Wow, I feel so spoiled with this event right now. All these Pokemon are just... dropping easy. I'm getting, I bet this rate these experience candies feel like they're for free. It's so awesome. I have to check how long this event even lasts again, because this is really amazing. This is something else, for sure. I wish this event lasted forever. If it did, I would absolutely max out every Pokemon I have. No problem. Okay, let's see how much experience candy we got. Got a few. We're starting to not get... feel like as many as before, but the Pokemon's level is still going up a lot. Wow, level 64 Dreadnought is on now. Nice. Just out of curiosity, I might check if there's actually any... more here. It's a bug one. I think that's the one I had too hard of a time with. There's a thunder. How are there so many? There's too many. I think they're just continuing to spawn over and over endlessly. If they're actually endless, that is extremely generous of the Pokemon company to just 
Let these terror raids all just keep coming. That's awesome. Should really check how long this event even is going on again because I'm enjoying this. I'm eating up this event a lot. I get to max out a lot of my Pokemon's levels. Till September for- Wait. From Wednesday, August 9th to August 17th. But then again, from September 1st to 17th. So there will be- Once the wave is over, it'll come back again. Wow. Cool. I'm definitely a fan of this event for sure. My favorite event having participated in the whole game, I think. Just getting so much experience candy to be leveling my moms with. It's really cool. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe.